get into our next segment here on the last ball battle rap podcast if y'all on the live chat make sure y'all hit that like button one time for us man salute to y'all let's get into our rising star segment where we hey. highlight somebody in the culture man that we think are up and coming stars within their realm and their element i'm gonna let the great miss lisa start off with her rising star for this week that's nice. All right. So I have chosen an uh, up and coming Fem C who I have watched, who I have, you know, gave a little mentorship to, um, someone who's now getting a lot of looks and buzz, and that's Miss Ill With It. Um, Miss Ill With It, she is a fire Fem C. She just did a battle recently on um, Verbal War Zone versus Butter on the Block. And she's been putting in work for a minute. She done battled on. You know, from Philly, butter from the black from Philly. She battled on Rebel Wars. She battled him. She battled Ooh, him. Oh, he fire on that platform. Yeah. I gotta see yeah. that battle. She went that's so cool. and and today I had just seen a clip from the battle, and I was like, shit, I like talk. You know what I'm saying? Like, I've been seeing her, but just to see her in her element, I'm just like, I can be nothing more than proud of her. So I definitely wanted to, you know, shine some light on her because she's been, you know doing a lot of small leagues, Showtime and Cypher City and even We Go Hard and you know, I just want to give her that love back. Fem C's giving other Fem C's love back and the fact that she's got tunnel vision. She's focused on the bag. She's focused on the look and becoming somebody and not one of these chatty patty female battle rappers doing the bullshit. She's out here to rap and show people that she got it. And, you know, another good person that's close to her that, you know, keep her focused in the game is another uh, uh, person in the media. She loves battle rap and they, they run together. So it's just the fact that she has a great mentor on that side and uh, I'm a great mentor to her. She's definitely doing what she's supposed to do. So salute, Miss Ill with it. Keep doing what you're doing. I'm watching you and I know you're going to be a great rising star sooner than enough. You think she's ready for Queen of the Ring already? Spawn oh, yeah. session at least? Yes. Okay. Debo, put my bitch on a motherfucking spawn recession. ASAP, nigga. That's what's I done up. seen a few of these spawn session bitches and you could have kept them bitches <laughs> in the goddamn trash can. I'm just saying. So get some bitches who can really rap, you know what I'm saying? So from the first time I met her when I did uh, the man versus woman car versus Myers, and she was on there, and she was battling for her now, when she just battled Butter, it's evolution, it's, it's, she's changing, she's upgrading, and she's growing, and um, the more you grow, the more I just, I become more proud, so keep doing what you gotta do, mama, I'm watching you, Debo, get my bitch a spot, the fuck you talking about? That's dope. My rising star for this week, man, we're gonna have to take this thing out to London, one of my media peers, my guy Trouble with the Wire Tap. He's a dope media outlet um, dealing with battle rap for the UK out in London. Um, he definitely be live streaming on Twitter. He live stream on YouTube as well. He be tapped in exclusive interviews, uh, dope content, dope content. He another dude I have reached out to when I would do my 30 for 30 uh, battle rap documentary projects. I had did one on racism and battle rap. There was okay. a couple things that was going on out in London in that battle rap scene. It was a lot of racist shit going on. I reached out to dude. He was real easy to work with. You know, I had him a part of my project, man. Real good, solid dude. So I really think that Trouble is going to be a rising star as far as media come in the battle rap culture because he he just on top of his job and he about innovating. And like I said, they out in the UK and the battle rap scene is hot out in London. Like people can't get it twisted, man. The battle rap scene is real hot out London, yo. Yeah, I'll be seeing it because that's why Smack went out there that time because he know. They know what time it is. So yep. salute to you, brother. Like I said, <clears throat> I'm watching. Like I said, I got a few supporters that are out there also. So just to see that more people are coming to, uh, you know, get into the battle rap world, whether it's media or it's rap, I salute you all because hip hop is, is, is national. It's, it's all over. It ain't just in America. It ain't just in the Bronx. It ain't just in the dirty South. It's all It's over. everywhere. It's everywhere. And, everywhere. And, they not, and they not copycatting over there. Like you got my girl Phoenix Fire. They got my girl uh, London Jen. Um, like they over there and they, they, they covering and they not, and I fuck with them because they not trying to build their brand off of U.S. battles. 
Like they they building up their own and talking about their own platforms and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? That's they it. they're tapping to our shit as well. But you know, I, I respect them hundred percent, man, over there doing their thing. That's a fact. Keep doing your thing. I I love it. I love it.